Hello and thank you for joining us for the first in a series of videos demonstrating the ease of use of Red Lion's Crimson software. My name is Doug Flanders and I'm the Senior Director of Sales for America's West. We'll be starting the series by showing just how easy it is to do protocol conversion utilizing Crimson software. Crimson is available for download on redlion.net. This powerful software programs a majority of Red Lion's portfolio of automation products including the Flex Edge, CR and Graphite HMIs, data collection and control products, as well as panel meters and more. There are 300 plus protocols to choose from, making Crimson's library of protocols the largest in the industry. Protocol conversion enables customers to do the following, bridge the gap between legacy and new platforms, connect assets, and extend the lifespan of existing equipment. Now I'd like to introduce Joe Slattery, Field Application Engineering Manager for America's West to demonstrate just how easily and quickly we can connect several devices with different protocols from multiple manufacturers. Thanks, Doug. In this demonstration, I'll first connect the Modbus serial device to the DA70. Second, I'll read in data from a Rockwell PLC over Ethernet. And finally, we'll show how easy it is to move data out to a third device using Modbus TCP IP. This is Crimson 3.1 software. On the left is a navigation pane. We're going to be focusing on the network and serial port settings. In the center is where most of the editing occurs. And on the right is a resource pane, which contains a list of things that are already defined or pre-configured within Crimson. For example, if I select display pages, I can go grab a gauge and pull it in from the resource pane. We're going to first configure RS-485 port. We're going to go to pick and select Modbus Universal Master. I now have a Modbus serial device configured. I'm going to select that device and just rename it meter. Next I'm going to go to data tags, hit the drop down list and select numeric tag. In this case I want to bring in a temperature value. Next I'll pick source, select meter, and bring that value in as a holding register. In just a few steps it shows how quickly we can read in data from a device. You can see now in the resource pane the temperature tag. I could go into display pages, right click on the gauge, go to properties, and now drag and drop that value into gauges to begin graphical configuration. Next I'll set up Ethernet communications to my Allen Bradley PLC. To do this I'll select pick, Allen Bradley, and select the driver. Next, I'll select PLC1. Within the configuration, I have the ability to import the native tags from the PLC. The native tag file is called L5K file. I'm gonna select Tag Management, Import L5K file, open it, and now I have direct access into those tags and I can quickly and easily map them into the Crimson database. Now watch carefully while we demonstrate protocol conversion by moving the Allen Bradley PLC data and the meter data out to a Modbus TCP IP device. I'm going to add a Modbus TCP IP master. I'm just going to rename this Modbus. I'm going to right click on this and add a gateway block. I'll now define this block as Modbus holding registers. I'll create a block size of three and you can see the direction is DA72 device. So now I'm simply going to select the 40,001 register. I can now go up to my PLC data and map those tags directly to the Modbus device. In addition, I can go to my tags and pull in my meter data and also map that information out over Modbus TCP IP. In just a few minutes, I was able to integrate three unique devices with three protocols. Thank you, Joe. Building on what was just demonstrated, I'd like to share a quote from a known user of Redline's Crimson software. They stated, drag and drop protocol conversion. No hoops, no scripting, no workaround required.
As we move forward with our series of ease of use videos, we'll be shifting focus into connectivity to enterprise and SCADA systems, as well as IAOT and cloud-based platforms using standard features within Crimson. These include MQTT, OPC UA client server, FTP client server, and SQL sync server and query. Thank you for taking the time to explore Red Lion solutions. For further information on Red Lion and our line of industrial automation and networking products, please contact a local Red Lion distributor or use the contact information provided on this slide.